over the years, he pushed this boulder of Armenian genocide recognition up many hills, only to find it sadly roll back down. And I have no doubt that when President Biden finally recognized the Armenian genocide a few short days after Vartan passed away, that he breathed a deep sigh of relief, because I think it was really as much about relief as anything uh, up there in heaven. Uh, Vartan, of course, was not only about the place he left uh, as a little boy or about what happened to his uh, his family and, and his ancestors. Uh, he was so much about building America. He had an only in America sense of his own story. And that's why he did so much to support first generation immigrants, giving them educational opportunities, promoting naturalization, uh, directing millions in funding to help refugees and immigrants at home and abroad. Vartan was a mischievous and marvelous storyteller. And often, as I alluded to earlier, he told stories about his own personal heroes. As he put it, I wanted people to know that life is not all cynical, that there are kind, wonderful people who do good things, help other people out of a sense of humanity, charity, religious obligation, ethnic pride, whatever. There was one kind, wonderful person who loomed largest of all. And that was Vartan, and I miss him, so thank you.